high heels and your feet with Dr. Stephen Palmer. Physically, it comes down to um, what, what women or people in general who like to wear heels get out of that, and that's the slender look, being taller. If you tolerate it, you can tolerate it. If there are ongoing problems, then there's gotta be a balance. The stiletto type heels, walking on a peg, that might be the size of perhaps a dime. You can sprain your ankle wearing a heel, you can break your ankle wearing a heel. And then if you do it repeatedly, you can actually develop uh, something called lateral ankle instability. Because of that forefoot loading, you're walking essentially on the ball of the foot. There's a very common thing we see called metatarsalgia, which is just an inflammatory joint pain from that excessive or repetitive loading in the ball of the foot. Changing your shoes, putting arch supports in your shoes to load your arch, offload the ball of the foot. The typical things like icing and anti-inflammatory medications to help. Sometimes we use steroid injections. Find heels that you can wear, that you can tolerate. Um, maybe altering the height of the heel. So the stilettos are two, three, four inches. Lowering that, a more stable heel, more of a block heel versus the little stiletto thing that you're, the little peg you're walking on uh, can make a difference.